I've always wanted to photograph Samuel Beckett since 1972. And um, as you, most people know, the man is a very reclusive man. He doesn't like the camera. But in 1980, I knew he was in London. And he was staying at the High Park Hotel. And um, I went down to see him. And the commissioner, I, I said, I'd like to speak to Mr. Beckett. And the commissioner phoned up his room. And I heard him say, there's a newspaper photographer down here. Uh, I'd like to see you. And the message came back, Mr. Beckett is not in. Well, that annoyed me. So anyway, I wrote him a note saying, yes, I am a newspaper photographer, but more importantly, I'm Irish. And I've been photographing a thigh now for you know, many, many years. I would love to show you the pictures, and more particularly, a series of photographs uh, under Wake, knowing Beckett's relationship in Paris with Joyce and the factification around Finnegan's Wake. I thought he might like to see the pictures. I left a note, and I phoned up the next morning, and I was asked who's calling. I said, it's Mr. Minahan, and I was put straight through to his room. He said, Mr. Han, thank you for your note. I would like to see the pictures of a thigh and a wake. How about nine o'clock the next day? I saw him in the hotel. He went very carefully through the photographs and, and, and just came across, looked at the pictures and came across this shot of Peter Boland. And I'm rather proud about this because he looked quite a long time and said, who is he? And I said, that's Peter Boland. And I said, he's a friend of mine. I've been photographing a thigh for years. And he said, it's a fine portrait. At that stage, I didn't realize what a Beckettian character was. I now realize that there are, that, that, that certain characters in the tie are very much Beckettian characters. So that was my initial introduction. <coughs> I then drove him from the hotel to the Riverside Studios where he was directing. And I, he allowed me to take more photographs. Having already photographed him in the hotel room, he, he then uh, allowed me to take more photographs of him uh, at the Riverside Studios. Then I met him again in 1984. And he was writing to me at this stage. I'd write to him and said, uh, fine, love to see you. He said to me, glad to see you in Paris, provided you leave your camera at home.